Okay guys, today we're gonna do something fun! Yeah. Yeah. this picture on Pinterest like a while ago and I was like whoa I want to make this cover-up I mean this whole set looks awesome but I really want to make this and it looks very simple so if you zoom in which I will for you it looks like we're gonna do double crochet and it's gonna be four green four white obviously we're not gonna use those colors because I don't have them but also because we want to do something different and so what i did i'm talking so fast because i'm so excited Whew, chill. so what i did is i so i'm gonna do 72 chains in the back this should be very simple it looks like you're just making two squares um three squares one big rectangle in the back and then two long ones in the front and you're doing so i did 72 chains for the back divide by eight that's nine nine like i guess cubicles that we're gonna have so yeah so let's start working on this i'm super excited for this project we will be using these two colors and a 3.5 millimeter hook and just double crochet anyway Earl's daughter you married update you how far i've gotten before i go out and eat some dinner but this is what it looks like it looks awesome so far we have quite a bit of ways to go because it's gonna be pretty long so let's keep going tomorrow and then see where we get food was okay we ordered some three appetizers coconut shrimp ragoons with pineapple and cream cheese and seaweed salad and then i ordered some pho but i didn't like mine at all hi guys a quick life update so this weekend i wasn't able to crochet at all because i was um, looking for apartments because we have to move at the end of the june so this is what i have so far so i guess i did do a few rows so we're gonna keep going because i want this to be long so a couple more rows and then we'll start decreasing and making the dimples on the side so let's keep going and then see how it goes So I just finished the back piece. It's gonna go like this. And I decrease a few rows by four times on each side to make it a really like high dimple, I guess. Like, I guess more sharper. And then I went straight without any decreases. So this is the back piece. So now let's work on our front piece, uh, two front pieces, and then we'll be done. So let's keep going. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe so I can make more videos like this and continue my work. So I just want to do a quick update. It's 4.30. I'm about to go outside and I finished the first front piece. Sorry, the bright. It's kind of bright in the back. And I, I'm almost done with the second one. And so tonight, I think I'll finish this one. And then tomorrow, let's attach everything together, do the outside. We're just gonna do outside in uh, maroon, not ribbing, but I'll show you what I'm gonna do, probably single crochet, and then we should be done. So yeah, so almost there guys, I'm super excited. It's looking good so far, so we'll see. Whoop. So I just finished both sides, so now let's attach it. We're almost done and see how it looks. I'm a little nervous, but I'm always nervous when I attach things, but let's try our luck. So let's put it on. Make 
make sure this is the right side. Yes, it is the right side. I will change. I don't think it will look good with this t-shirt, but it looks good. You lower it a little bit. Yeah. So now we're gonna do a single crochet all the way around in maroon at the bottom and around the sleeve to make it a hard edge. And then at the top, oh, I wonder how we're gonna do it. There's supposed to be like a mark, like, um, not a mark, a um, few rows of chains to kind of tie it into like a bow if you wanna keep it close, like this. Should I do it? Mm, I probably should that's what I wanted to so let's play around oops sorry let's play around uh, so let me do the ribbing first and then I'll be back so I actually have a little end left at the bottom of one of the sides so what I'm gonna do is I'm actually just gonna attach the yarn the way I usually attach my yarn and then just continue doing single crochet all around the front so let's do that and then I'll meet you at the I love the pattern. It's very comfy and breathable. We did a good job on this project. I'm kind of considering if I should put buttons down the middle or if I should, yeah, just tie it right here. Just make two marks. But right now I'm gonna leave it like this. I really like it. It's perfect for a beach or a hot summer, which is pretty hot right now outside. It's like in the high 80s. So yeah, glad how it turns out. So thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you on my next video.